Yeah. If you're getting ready to take the dog out for a walk this morning, they bring need your some umbrella. rain boots or something this morning. <laughs> it's going to be one of those days. I'm sure they're in and out. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Or they're out and back in real yes. quick. Um, it's going to be it's going to be one of those very wet mornings and there are a few lightning strikes out there as well. So I want you to be prepared for that. Lightning is a threat within any thunderstorm, even though it is not severe. We just don't want to be outside, and we certainly have a lightning in the vicinity. Five Doppler 13 radar. We're going to start off on the northern extent of the state. This is where the heaviest rain has been falling during the overnight, where you see these reds on the radar. It's rain falling at about a half an inch per hour, and that's quickly going to lead to some localized flooding, ponding on the sides of roadways, secondary roads, things like that. From Huntington over to Peru, Logansport seeing some of that heavier rainfall. The lightning strikes are more widespread within this cluster of rain right here from Frankfurt down to Lebanon. This extends throughout Montgomery County. We've got a lightning strike just to the south of Crawfordsville right now. This is going to be the trend over the next several hours. In fact, we've got a lot more rain back to our west all along this boundary that's pushing in heavy rainfall and a line of storms that's now developing in central Illinois working its way in our direction. So through the mid morning, that's where we're going to keep the heaviest of the rain in play here in central Indiana. Temperatures much cooler today as well. We'll hold steady here in the mid to upper 40s through the course of the afternoon. That's about as good as we do. So certainly going to be a cooler day, a breezy one. The rain sticking around as well. This is the severe weather outlook for later today. This is a level one of five from the storm prediction center. It does include Columbus, Greensburg down to Seymour, and that's where that potential is some very strong wind gusts embedded within some of these thunderstorms. Let's walk you through the timeline. Heavy rain is going to continue through the mid morning. This is at 8 a.m. Noticing the temperature difference as well. This boundary is going to be a cutoff through the central part of the state. It's going to be much cooler to the north, where this particular weather model even picks up on perhaps a brief wintry mix just to the north of Fort Wayne. We're going to keep it all rain for us here locally and heavy at times. This is through noon when the heaviest of the rain moves through, but we've got a temperature difference from 39 up in Kokomo around noon today, near 50 in the city. And we've got temperatures that will be pushing the mid to upper 60s across the southern extent of the south of uh, central Indiana, I should say, where that boundary puts us in the warm sector. Another round of rain possible through the afternoon. This is through 5 p.m. And then eventually this will push out, getting into the evening by 8 o'clock. I believe most of this rain wraps up. And we'll start to clear the sky out as we go into the overnight and much cooler temperatures arrive as well. The heaviest of the rainfall right here along the central and north central parts of the states where some of us uh, could see in excess of two inches of rainfall. So just be aware of that localized flooding threat. Much cooler overnight as we drop back into the 30s, potentially a frosty start to the day in some outlying locations. But at least we bring back a little sunshine and dry weather to get next week started. 54 at noon, we're back to 60 for a high as we look ahead. It's our Monday. Mostly sunny sky is going to continue through the first part of the week, but also these uh, cooler temps overnight lows only going to be in the 30s. We're back to 62, mostly sunny on Wednesday, 63 on Thursday, and a dry stretch of weather takes us through next weekend.